the world of transportation just changed forever. Today, BYD's CEO, Wang Chuanfu, made an announcement that has left the auto industry reeling and consumers stunned. This isn't just a new car or a minor upgrade, it's a complete rewrite of the rules. From Shenzhen, BYD revealed a breakthrough that could fast forward the global shift to electric vehicles by decades. The impact? Everything from daily commutes to global energy markets is now in flux. BYD claims to have solved the three biggest EV hurdles, battery life, charging time, and cost, all at once. The auto giants, Tesla, Volkswagen, Ford, are suddenly playing catch-up. BYD's stock soared, rivals' shares plummeted, and the industry faces an extinction-level threat for those who can't adapt. The race for the future of the automobile has been reset overnight. In this video, we'll break down BYD's history, the science behind the announcement, and what it means for the world. Experts weigh in on the consequences for economies, politics, and society. The next chapter of our automotive future began today. To grasp the magnitude of today's news, you need to know BYD. Founded in 1995 as a battery maker, BYD's expertise in battery tech became its secret weapon. In 2003, it entered the auto business, betting on affordable, practical EVs for the masses, not luxury models. BYD controls its entire supply chain, from raw materials to final assembly, slashing costs and speeding up innovation. Today, it's a global EV powerhouse, outselling rivals in China and exporting electric buses worldwide. Their mission, make EVs reliable, accessible, and affordable for everyone. That's why today's announcement matters. BYD has the scale and know-how to deliver on big promises. When BYD speaks, the industry listens. The centerpiece of today's announcement is the BYD Eternal Battery, a solid-state battery that sounds like science fiction. It delivers a verified 2,000-kilometer range, over 1,200 miles, on a single charge, tripling current EV standards. Charging 10 to 80% in just 5 minutes at BYD's new photon charging stations. The secret, a crystalline electrolyte structure that enables rapid, safe charging and eliminates heat issues. The battery lasts 2 million kilometers and 20 years, outliving most cars. It's 30% cheaper to produce thanks to cobalt-free materials, and those savings go straight to consumers. BYD's first car with this tech, the Seal U Plus SUV, hits mass production in January 2026, launching in China, Europe, and Latin America. North America follows later that year, pending approvals. BYD will license the tech to other automakers starting in 2028. This isn't a concept, it's production ready. As Wang Chuanfu put it, we offer the world a new freedom, clean, endless, affordable mobility. The announcement came at 10 a.m. Beijing time in a minimalist setting at BYD's R&D Center. The audience, journalists, analysts, officials, waited in tense anticipation. CEO Wang Chuanfu opened with a history of energy and transportation, then dropped the bombshell, the eternal battery. The room erupted as journalists rushed to report, and analysts recalculated forecasts. Wang used simple, powerful numbers. 2,000 kilometers, 5-minute charge, 2 million kilometer lifespan. Third-party data and extreme weather test videos backed up every claim. The shocker BYD's entire lineup will be retrofitted with the new battery starting in 2027. BYD also announced BYD Energy using the battery for grid-scale storage to stabilize renewables. This is bigger than cars. It's about transforming global energy. As the live stream ended, over 100 million viewers had tuned in. The world's media called it the most significant industrial announcement of the century. The market's reaction was instant. Disbelief, panic, and awe. Major auto stocks were halted to prevent a crash. When trading resumed, Tesla and legacy automakers lost billions. BYD's stock hit record highs, and its suppliers soared. Emergency meetings erupted at every major car company. Suppliers of old battery tech faced extinction, while those in advanced materials saw opportunity. Consumers hit pause on buying other EVs, waiting for BYD's new models. 
BYD hasn't just launched a product, it's frozen the market for its competitors. The geopolitical shock is as big as the tech leap. Oil's grip on global power is slipping. Cars that go 1-200 miles on a cheap charge mean less demand for oil. Oil exporters face economic upheaval. Importers gain strength. For the first time, a Chinese company leads the auto industry, shifting economic and political power. Western governments must choose, protect their industries or race to catch up. The ripple effects are everywhere. Cheaper transport lowers costs, transforms logistics, and slashes inflation. The energy sector must pivot fast. Less gasoline, more electricity, and massive investment in renewables and grid storage. Eternal batteries could power entire cities, making energy independence possible. But new dependencies emerge. BYD controls the tech, materials, and IP. The world's leaders are scrambling to respond. The eternal battery will reshape how we live, not just how we drive. With 2,000 kilometers of range, distance becomes irrelevant. People can live farther from cities, revitalizing rural areas. Affordable EVs democratize clean transportation, benefiting lower income families most. Cities will be quieter, cleaner, and healthier as pollution and noise drop. Public spaces can be reclaimed for parks and people, not just cars. But the transition will disrupt jobs in oil, gas, and traditional auto sectors. Retraining and support are essential. Urban planning must adapt to prevent sprawl and ensure connected, sustainable communities. The choices we make now will shape the society this technology creates. Dr. Aris Thorne, automotive analyst, calls this a revolution, not an evolution. BYD's leap in solid-state batteries was expected a decade from now. Delivering it today is an iPhone moment for cars. Automakers now face a stark choice, spend years and billions catching up, or license BYD's tech in 2028. Expect new alliances and partnerships as survival depends on access to this battery. Governments, especially in the West, are under pressure. Protectionism could backfire, but so could inaction. The likely response, a massive, government-funded push to close the gap. The real breakthrough? BYD has solved energy storage, not just for cars, but for the entire grid. Cheap, long-lasting, fast-charging batteries will accelerate renewables, stabilize power, and transform industries. Wang Chuanfu didn't just unveil a better car battery, he launched a foundational technology for a post-carbon world. The 21st century may now be divided into two eras, before the eternal battery and after. The world must adapt or be left behind. The future is here. November 1st, 2025 marks the dawn of a new era in mobility. BYD's eternal battery has redrawn the auto industry, shifted global power, and given humanity a new tool against climate change. The EV is now the superior choice no compromises, just freedom. Legacy automakers and governments must adapt fast or risk irrelevance. The race to match or license this tech will drive a wave of innovation, benefiting consumers everywhere. The old questions, where will I charge? How far can I go? Are now obsolete. We stand at a crossroads. This leap offers cleaner air, stable energy, and greater mobility for all. But technology is only a tool. How we use it will define the next century. The journey starts now.